We are back on Sister Circle Live, and joining us at the table is comedian George Wallace. Hello, 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 everybody. Hello. Yes. I'm so happy. Yes, and since we are here at the table, we want to do something different. What George thinks. Yes. So we're going to. What gonna... do I be, because th I be thinking. Yes, I, 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 yeah. I be thinking. I be thinking. How about that? Yes. Well, this is, yes. is going to be good. Yes. Can well, I say it on TV? Yes, yes. you can. You just keep it clean. And we want to we wanna really know your real thoughts now. Okay. Keep it 100. I will keep it 100. I'll try to do that. Okay. Uh, well, listen. Uh, 100. We, we recently lost the Queen of Soul, Aretha Franklin. And yeah. I hear that a lot of people were unhappy, including her family, with how some of the things were ran in the, in the, ch in the church during the funeral. Mm -hmm. uh, let's say one, all, Reverend it Jasper it Williams. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. Okay, it's over. Okay, that's cool. But, but they, they, they were very unhappy with Reverend Jasper Williams. They, they said, you know, uh, they were unhappy with this eulogy, mm -hmm. and they were unhappy uh, and said that he uh, uh, touched um, Ariana, Ariana Grande, Grande inappropriately. So there were a lot of things there that uh, the people were. Was unhappy he the with. one that touched on? Yeah, he just uh -huh. grabbed uh -huh. uh -huh. I saw that. I yeah, thought was, that was, was the other bishop, but that was that was the guy. It was other bishop, right? It, oh, it was other bishop it, in the church. In any case, oh, when, there we go. Okay. When yeah. black people hug each other in the church, you don't know. I he, I don't think he meant to do it. Yeah, no, I, I think he was just genuine, I and I thought he was uh, honest, and mm -hmm. and um, and we tend to do jokes before we know it, you know. And people are too. PC now. Uh -huh. you know, yeah, I don't do that. If you come to my show, I talk about anybody and everybody. <laughs> so what he did, they were just looking at something. He grabbed her wrong. She didn't say anything. They said something. You yeah, know? yeah. And, uh, I, it could have been the height because she's she's a she's little, a little shorter, shorter and he's a little mm -hmm. taller. So well, it I been just think God bless you, preacher. Just don't do it again, okay? Yeah. <laughs> so he did it. And sometimes I said we do things. That I don't do a PC show. Like I had a blind lady come to my show last night in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, mm -hmm. and I chewed her out for coming in late. If you do it right, I said, you got somebody leading, guide you around, and you walking here late. I said, look at all these other people in here. Look at these people. She she's going like, and she said, she's going like that. And she going, and I said, you ain't that blind because you pointing straight at me. The fact of the matter is that if you do it right and properly, everybody wants to laugh. Right. And this lady laughed so hard during the whole show. I, 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 I swear to you, I, can I say swear? Yeah. Anyway, at the end of the show, I gave her a copy of my, I gave her a copy of my DVD. Nice. Yeah, yeah. Nice. But she can't watch it. Oh, she, but she can't. No, but so the preacher, Aretha Franklin funeral, you know, it was a long funeral. She planned the funeral, so it was long, and, you know, black people tend to have long funerals. And, yeah, uh, that was... But this, well, you know, what can you do? What can you say? It's over. Uh, I apologize that it was that long to the people that don't like it. But, uh, but George, what do, I mean, what do you think of this? Now, listen, she planned this beautiful, elaborate funeral, but there's no will. What do you think about that? Well, see, so you got to get a will now, people. Uh, yeah, at least get a trust. Mm -hmm. I got one. You got one. I'm going to put y'all in my trust when I go home today. Really? Well, put me on it. Well, you know I lie for a living. <laughs> <laughs> but listen, listen, listen. She, they, she doesn't have a will. I hope they get that together. I hope yeah, they don't that's fight off. Right that's right a, $80 million dollars is enough to split and shut up, right? Yeah, you take, four They could give me I 10, and I just say, y'all take the rest Man, and leave me alone. Let me, get, let me get 250000 <laughs> oh, You're easy. You're easy to work with. You're easy. Oh, my God. I can imagine you're a smile with $250,000. Oh, like, man. But yeah, we, we miss her, and I just knew her. Yeah. I knew her when she was a kid singing here in Atlanta yeah. with her father, you know. Mm -hmm. And she was not only the queen of soul, she was the queen of gospel for me. Mm. She was the queen of rock and roll. Everything Aretha did, everything she did, I will never stop listening to her music. Mm. Yeah. R-E-S-P-E-C-T. Sometimes mm -hmm. I can't even spell it, but this lady was the greatest <laughs> singer. Join the ranks. Yeah. 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 You can sing. Sing it. R-E-S-P-E-C-T. R-E-S-P-E-C-T. Yes! Oh. Find out what it means to me. Yeah. <laughs> you guys are good. Thank you. Yeah, you know, we I don't like coming here. <laughs> when y'all gonna stop putting coffee in these coffee cups? That's uh, all. Is that what you want, Bobby? You have to ask the people. Man, Tell coffee the people costs too much, too much money. And I told the producer to get me some coffee. And he said, I have to pay for it. It's $8 for a cup of coffee now. It's so you need to call it, what, at four bucks, not Starbucks. Four bucks. <laughs> all right, we got more questions for you. Go ahead, Trina. Okay, now, Mr. Wallace. Dr. Wallace, Dr. Wallace. Oh, Don't you feel you better, better, you better since you're talking you to me? Come on, Trina. All right, now. <laughs> now, you're about to go back on tour again with some more and Mike Epps. Oh, yeah. You've been doing this for a super duper long time. Yeah. Do you ever get tired? No, you can't get tired of loving. I have a gift. I love going out with some more. That's a whole new market at mm -hmm. Mike Epps. See, that's why I keep in touch with these young kids. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. And I'm having fun. I'm talking about the rappers. The last time I was here, I talked about Waka Flocka. Ooh. I talked about him. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's my new curse word, by the way. Yes. You, you yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And so now I'm talking about the, the weekend. Uh -huh. I don't think I like him because who the hell does he think he is taking three days? How come he can't take one day like everybody? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and, yeah, I talk about him. I talk about the, the future. I, talk, I call him the future. The future. We don't know what he's rapping about because, you know, he. 
He's ahead of us. You know. So I'm talking right. about all he's, of these rappers been having so much. I just love the young kids that go down and talk about them. I talk about the, y'all buying the YouTube. Yeah. YouTube buying jeans now for three hundred fifty dollars with holes in them. No, I when I grew up, we didn't buy no damn holes. We had real holes in our pants. <laughs> right, right, right. You know I mean? So yeah. it's just, just to be with these young kids and, and they love me when I just do, doing their music mm -hmm. and having fun. It's just good to go out on tour. And we're coming to a city near you. We come to North Virginia. We come to Cleveland. We come to every city in America. That Tampa, Florida, get ready. Atlanta, Phillips Arena. We're coming back here. Yes. And if you can't laugh in Atlanta, you can't laugh. It's State anywhere. Farm. It's State anywhere. Farm now. This we changed it. It, 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 it is State Farm. State <laughs> Farm, yes. I, I, I knew that. I that's read right, that. That's right. That's right. So, you also have upcoming movies with Cat Williams and Sinbad. Two Minutes of Fame. Yeah. Yes. And, uh, um, uh, what's that girl with the blonde hair? Ooh, uh, I don't know. Stuff with an heart from Oakland. In any case, uh -huh. all the comedians going to be in it. Yeah. It's great. it's great. I got a movie with Sonal Lathan. You mentioned mm -hmm. that. Yeah. Napoli Ever After. Tell us about oh, that. Napoli yes. Ever After. Yes. Made right here in Atlanta. You know Atlanta's number one in movie making, film making. Now. Yes, of course. Everything is in this city. Ooh. And if it, we did the movie Napoli Ever After. It was so wonderful working with us. Yeah. Good, you know? mm -hmm. And I got a little role. You know, I'm just doing a lot of stuff now. And, and you, we talked about Law and Order. I'm coming back to do that. And we did a, there's a movie with um, Richard Dreyfuss mm -hmm. and uh, Chevy Chase called The Last Laugh. And, we're just working our butt off, and it's just good to work and just be able to do what you want to do in life. Yeah. I, I wish everybody watching, make sure you enjoy your life. Oh, okay? yes. oh that's good. Even if you get a, a degree in marketing, doesn't mean you got to do statistical analysis. You might that's enjoy right. arranging flowers or painting cars. Whatever you have a passion for, make sure the money will come. Yes, yes, the absolutely. The money will come. I see you guys. You don't do nothing for a living. You do nothing for a living, and, that's <laughs> and you enjoy it, don't you? I love it. And love they it. give you a check every week, and all you got to do is sit here. <laughs> And just, and and smile. just smile. I mean, it takes a lot of work to do this. It does. Contrary to popular they, they, belief, it's you It's like know being it. on tour, you know, coming yes. up with these jokes every day. You got It's a lot of work. It is a lot you of work. You know what's going on in the world like Trump? Trump has got us doing things we thought we'd never do. Oh. We thought we'd never do. What you think about that? Well, it got things like, you never in your life thought you would see George Bush on TV and go, hey! Right! It's like, hey! It's that nice guy! Right he right loves, back. He loves like Michelle. Right. He loves Michelle. Every time he gets around Michelle, like, you know, so he's just, it's just writing these jokes and enjoying right. life. Right. So it's not as easy as people think it, it is. It is. Yeah. It is. So, it is. But shout out to our amazing team. We cannot yes. do this without them. Right. Shout out to you, Mr. Wallace, for leading we the way. You. I have not lots only, of yes. jokes. I didn't yes. get to do any of my jokes. So what are jokes saying? I got a joke on Patty LaBelle, Sweet Potato Pie. I'm the only black person. Person ever taste a sweet potato pie? Mm -mm. Did you ever taste? It? They say it's. Uh, some people I, I say it's good. It. Some people say it's. I, 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 I don't like it. stuff. I, in I don't know what she's I, putting in there, but I tell you what. If you go to the store and buy the crust in the pan, that's two forty eight. Uh -huh. She's selling the pie for three forty eight, so she ain't putting but a dollar worth of stuff in there, whatever mm. it is. <laughs> well, Mr. Ross, we got to roll. Right. We know you can go. Oh yeah. They need to come to your show in Vegas and come to your show with Sinbad and Cat Williams and all of that. Yes, Wallace stuff. at the Westgate. We got free parking. We got free food. We got everything for you, Wallace at the Westgate in Las Vegas. I'm the new Mr. Vegas. You can go to Las Vegas and see the blue man, or you can come see the black man. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much, Mr. Wallace. We appreciate you, George yes. Wallace, the legendary.